previously on Balls. Right, let's go to the phones at the Hangout. Jason Hartman, more coming from him this afternoon. Let's uh, quickly get hold of um, Stephen Sykes, former Shark. Now with the Kings, you say he's on his way to a meet and greet, Johnny? Uh, yes, a meet and greet, Darren. I think the Kings are getting a bit uh, worried about the opposition tomorrow. So things are a bit uh, stressful in oh, that now camp Now they're there. getting worried about the opposition. Well, I would imagine now is it uh, like, what do you call it, butterflies, eh? Yeah. Hello? Hey, Stephen. Hello, how are you doing? All right, new about Darren and John and Simon. We've got Jason Hartman here as well, the Hangout on Balls Radio and Mix 93.8 FM. Nice to chat to you again, buddy. Yeah, thanks so much. Awesome stuff. I know you've got to go head off to a meet and greet, so we just quickly wanted to touch base with you because I was saying, now does Stephen have a foot in both camps at the moment? Gee, I mean, <laughs> I was I was devastated when I heard that you left the Sharks. Yeah, thanks, man. Yeah, so now, uh, uh, you haven't had, have you had a game for them yet? Excuse me? Have you had a game for them yet? You have, you have had a, a couple of runs yeah, for the Kings I, already? I play, yes, I played last week when we played against uh, the fourth. Okay, so you um, basically your record for the Kings is played 1-1-1. One, one, one. You've got a 100% record with them. <laughs> so far, yes. <laughs> awesome stuff. Plus added the points for the uh, the break weekend. And, uh, yeah. yeah, I mean, what's the vibe like in PE as far as uh, as far as the Kings go? I must say it's a really great vibe. Uh, the guys are really enjoying the, the opportunity that they got to play Super Rugby. And uh, they're all very keen to, to, to prove a point. And... Uh, there's a lot of guys that's playing their first season of Super Rugby, so it's, it's mm. quite a big excitement for them. Obviously, the guys that are the experienced guys like yourself who've been there, done that, have uh, got to try and help some of the guys that haven't had that experience yet. I mean, has it been easy to sort of integrate the whole side? Yeah, there's a, there's a lot of uh, senior guys uh, in the team that, that makes it easier. So the guys are trying to help uh, where they can, and uh, I'm going say the young guys are very keen uh, to learn, and uh, they, they're really taking on the challenge. Yeah. No, look, there's no doubt you guys, even though you're playing at home, I mean, are you sort of, have you discussed it? Are you guys considering yourself as big underdogs for this game? Yeah, definitely. I think we're going to be underdogs in, in, in all the games, but uh, we're really looking forward to the to the challenge tomorrow against the Sharks. The Sharks have got a formidable outfit, and uh, it's going to, apparently it's going to be a sellout crowd, so it's going to be an interesting game. Are you expecting a bit of chirp? I'll have to see. <laughs> Are you expecting Bresler to have a couple of words? No, I don't think so. All right, cool, buddy. All right, so uh, big game tomorrow. Do you know how many tickets have sold for the game? Uh, apparently, there was uh, at lunchtime today, there were only 5,000 left, but wow. only yeah. ones and twos here and there. That's brilliant. Well, at, uh, look, yeah. at least EP uh, Port Elizabeth and uh, Kings Country have uh, really embraced your team. I think beating the force as well has certainly helped the cause as well. Um, so yep. uh, yeah there's a lot of excitement about the rugby in uh, P. just before you go though uh, Simon just going to quickly throw the games coming up the weekend let's get your thoughts on those just in terms of how you think they're going to go which way ok, okay. H- Highlanders Cheetahs uh, Highlanders alright Brumbies Tars uh, Brumbies yeah. Stormers Chiefs uh, I'll have to go with the Stormers what hey wow ok <laughs> ok you boys against the Sharks here we go. Now that's a big question, Stephen. What do you Kings. think? Kings, definitely. Kings, definitely. No doubt about it. By 20, eh? 25. <laughs> <laughs> Stephen, enjoy the weekend. And then one more, one more. Oh, one, more. one more, sorry. Blues Bulls Blues. on Sunday morning. Blues. Yeah, even a former Sharks ball never go with the Bulls. And then, Stephen, <laughs> don't take this the wrong way, but John Wallen can't believe you're Afrikaans. Yeah, but it's, uh, it's one of those things, eh? Now you speak beautiful English, Stephen. That's what I was saying. <laughs> Couldn't believe it. It happens in South Africa. Stephen, nice yeah. to chat you again, buddy. All the Thanks best. Enjoy the weekend. Okay. Thank Take you care. very much. Bye-bye. 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 Here we go. Stephen Sykes, former Sharks man, now EP King, or King, Southern King. Uh, giving the... Uh, the Kings' uh, chance of winning tomorrow is a lot of people on Twitter gave, doing as well. Also gave Stormers a chance. Yeah, I was, don't think I'll was good of him. Chiefs are going to take him by about seven. This is Balls Visual Radio. Darren, Simon, Kate, and John. Weekdays from three pm to six pm Central African time. Balls.co.za.